Welcome back to the morning blend and unfortunately here's a bummer across America. Kids are playing less than ever before. So Kaboom, a national nonprofit group is working hard to ensure all kids have a chance to achieve that active balance they need to thrive. And here with more is director of city initiatives at Kaboom. That's Maida Moon. Good morning to you. Good morning. Well, we really want to get into this because we want to get kids back outside and playing. So what really are the opportunities are there for play at these uh, 2016 Playful Cities? Our 2016 Playful Cities are doing a lot of great things to encourage kids to play. They have uh, mobile recreation units, which are big trucks filled with games and toys where they're taking kids um, uh, opportunities to play in playgrounds and parks. They have um, implemented recess policies. They have play days. They're doing so many amazing things to encourage kids to play in their community. And we know the city of Henderson is one of those being recognized as those playful cities. So how did Kaboom really select these cities? Cities have to apply to receive the playful city uh, applic sorry, the playful city recognition. So um, cities apply every year. We ask them to do three things. We ask them to submit a letter of support from their city or town or manager or their mayor. We ask them to uh, submit to us um, examples of play, so all of the innovative and cool things that they're doing. And we ask them to map their play spaces, so all of the playgrounds and ball fields and tennis courts. So Henderson might be on the list, but we can get Las Vegas on that list as well. Same for North Las Vegas. We would love Las Vegas. So why should cities really be concerned about the amount of play kids get? Because this is kind of a startling a little bit that kids aren't going outside more. Yes, unfortunately, play is disappearing amongst our kids. And it's really important that they play every day because it contributes to so many things. Um, it contributes to lowering obesity rates. It contributes to um, how well they do in school. It contributes to how they relate to others, their family, their friends, their peers. It's, it's extremely important and it's important to cities too because if a city prioritizes play, um, that's a place where families want to live and want to stay. So what can we do exactly to bring more play into our kids' lives? Yes, in order to bring play into kids' lives, think about the places where kids exist every day, where they are running errands with their parents, and try to insert play into those areas. Play on the sidewalk, play at bus stops, play at the laundromat, so that kids don't miss those really vital opportunities to play throughout the day. And it's really all about being active because it keeps you healthy. Get up and move a little bit. Exactly. Um, we definitely believe in active and balanced play for all kids. And you guys just launched something called the Play Everywhere Challenge. Does that kind of go with that itself? We're playing really, depending on where you're at, just go outside and get some work done. <laughs> yes, the Play Everywhere Challenge is a really exciting national competition that we just launched on May 1st. We are providing up to $1 million in grants for cities and nonprofits and community groups to share with us their most exciting and innovative ideas about how they can increase play in their community. So as I mentioned earlier, play in those like unexpected places where you wouldn't necessarily think that there'd be play at a bus stop or and play on the sidewalk, but that's where we want to see it. And to get more information about that, is there a certain website that we can go to just so our cities can get into this? <laughs> Please go to kaboom.org to learn more about Playful City USA, Play Everywhere Challenge, and Kaboom in general. All righty. Thank you so much for taking some time out this morning and bringing this uh, really to us because I didn't know about this. We're going to get those kids back outside and playing. Yes, we need all the help we can get. All righty. <laughs> thank thank you. you so much. Again, uh, Kaboom is making sure all families, no matter your background, have a chance to achieve that active balance. For more on them and to get on that contest, just head to the website right there on your screen and go Henderson. Congrats. That's my neck of the woods. Las Vegas, North Las Vegas, surrounding areas. You can get on this as well. <laughs> Guys, back over to you. <laughs> Micah, taking the whole city. <laughs> there task. you go. I like it.